everyone. Uh, my name is Fatin. Uh, I am uh, from Syria and I live in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates. First of all, I, um, I was looking at the video on YouTube and I saw a lot of candle carving um, in the world and I like the idea and I thought uh, of having this training and to be able uh, to do the same and to be a professional in candle carving. Uh, but I didn't think that this was um, easy. So I started looking uh, online and to find uh, a good training provider, a professional one. And I finally visited the Candle Boom um, uh, webpage and I, find that, uh, I found that they have a very nice uh, candle carving, very fine one, and I like it. And uh, I found that they do, the, um, they do the training. So I started contacting them and um, you know they were uh, very helpful uh, for me but you know uh, they told me that the training will be in Russia in Ekaterinburg so uh, the idea first it wasn't very comfortable for me I thought that you know this might be very difficult for me uh, to travel to Russia as uh, it's my first time here in Russia and especially to Yekaterinburg uh, as a city that, uh, that is not uh, very well known as a tourism destination, so I have no idea about it. But uh, because I like uh, the candle carving and I want to learn about it, um, I just uh, left uh, all my fears behind. And uh, I took the decision to come here and uh, to learn. Uh, to be honest, you know, it wasn't easy decision for me, but um, you know, the, I was very welcome here by the team and I feel very comfortable and the city is very beautiful, uh, especially that I came in the winter and I live in a very hot area in the United Arab Emirates, as you know. So um, it wasn't very, uh, very bad. Uh, I like the snow and I like the city and the people here are very friendly. Um, and I, um, the most important thing that I learned the candle carving uh, here with the team and uh, they were very helpful for me and I like it and I know that I am able to open my own business in the future so please see me in Abu Dhabi in the future. Bye bye.